Hi, this is Donna Campbell, librarian at Merida Middle School, teaching you how to make cereal box bookmarks today. They make great gifts. Now, all you're going to need is a cereal box or other form of box, a ruler, scissors, and a pen or pencil. Your first step is to find that empty box and then open it at both ends. Once you get both ends open, go ahead and take your scissors and cut down any one of the corners. It doesn't matter which one. Your goal is to get that box open and flat. So cut completely from the top to the bottom of the box and try to be neat. It's not critical though. The next step is to create a rectangle using your ruler. This is going to be the shape of your bookmark, one and a half inches by six inches. You can make your bookmark a little wider or a little longer. One and a half inches by six inches is a pretty standard bookmark size. Make sure to identify a part of the cereal box so we can make a fun bookmark. And once you have your rectangle made, you're going to go ahead and cut it out. Of course, the more accurately you cut, the more bookmarks you potentially will be able to make. And now this is our first completed bookmark. That first bookmark now becomes the template for additional bookmarks. Experiment with using your template horizontally, vertically, just use the graphics on the cereal box to their best advantage. You should be able to get a dozen or more bookmarks out of a large cereal box. Be sure to clean up your work area, recycle your scraps, and enjoy these upcycled bookmarks. If you'd like to share, send us a picture at libraries at sfusd.edu.